want to I just wanna get away and sit right next to you Welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys for tuning in once again. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe right now before we go any further. Thank you. I appreciate that. What we're doing today is a quick weave closure. I'm going to go ahead and cut off the excess lace from this beige cap. And what I did here was I used the black cap and a beige cap. I did the black cap first and then I left out the area that I was going to put that beige cap. And I went in second with the beige cap. So now I'm going in and I'm putting down my adhesive to lay down this closure. You want to make sure you put thin layers of glue so that it can dry. You're going to see this glue go from white to clear. And once it's clear, you know it's time to lay that lace down. So I'm just going to go ahead and smooth that on out. As you see, it's getting clear. I'm going to get my lace and I'm going to place it exactly where I want it to go. Now, this is the closure. And I want her to have that deep side part effect. So I took that closure and just placed it on the side to give her the effect of a full frontal without her having to buy a full frontal. So I'm going to start pulling out where I want her baby hairs to be. As you can see, that's looking very scalpish right now. I'm going to lay that down with my Valentine elastic band. That's going to keep that lace in place while I go ahead and finish off this style. Right here, I'm just gluing down that closure and blow drying it so it sets in place. Make sure you press that in real good good make sure it's not moving because we don't need that then i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna remove the excess lace on this closure we don't need that lace sticking out of this style that's just not cute now i'm gonna go ahead and i'm gonna start placing her tracks this is pretty pretty self-explanatory just go in with the tracks and put them in place um so I did speed this up a little bit more because it's pretty self-explanatory. If you need me to go into detail about my track placement, please just leave a comment and I definitely will do that. But yeah, I just put them in. Now it's time to layer the hair because if you know if you want to put in some curls, you have to layer it. It's just law. I mean, you could do curls without layering it, but then you're just going to have block curls. And that's not what we looking for. We looking for curls that pop. Curls that give us that. Mm. So you got to layer it. So I'm going to go ahead and start in the front. And I'm just going to slide cut the front so I can get that layer effect. And you know, you will know when you have the right amount of layers. It's all about the look you're going for. And you can feel it when it's right. So I'm just going to keep doing this until I feel like she has enough layers in the front to, to the point where when I curl it, it's, you know, sitting just right the way I need it to. So when you get ready to do it, you will see it too. So yeah, just, you know, use your own discretion. I'm pretty sure you will feel when you need to stop. So I'm going to keep going to my liking. I'm just going to keep putting layers in, raising it up, pulling it out, slide cutting it. Yes, 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 yes. And this color is just everything on her skin. It's popping already. We ain't even styled it yet. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yes, I'm loving it already. But yeah, go in and put my curls for the girls. Mm -hmm. Curling it up. Yes, I'm loving it already. It's just giving. It's giving what it's supposed to be giving, okay? Look at that. Excuse my back. I'm going to do better. <laughs> but yes, it's giving. It is giving. Can you see what it's giving? Do you see? It's just giving. I love it. 
don't forget to subscribe to my channel y'all i will be back with more videos and i promise you my back will not be in it okay love you bye